Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to go over this purse and tell you what fits in here. Ooh, so this is my Gucci Ophidia bucket bag and it's in the small size so it has the, the top handle. So when I was doing some research because I was interested in this bag, I noticed there weren't that many videos on YouTube for this particular style. So I wanted to show you kind of what fits in here. So this is considered a small, but it's actually pretty roomy. So I decided to keep this bucket bag and I returned the Speedy 25. So I'm going to show you what fits in here. So let's pull this fully open. And that's what it looks like. All right. So this is the Louis Vuitton compact wallet. So again, it's not the full size. So it's the smaller one. So I'll show you if it's in there. So it fits like that. And then I have my mini pochette. So there's some knickknacks in there. And this one that fits in there. So this is my sunglasses. That fits. And I have the round coin case. Yeah, so because this is a bucket style bag, I think it'll fit a lot. So I don't know if you want to stuff this because then it'll be hard to take things in and out. But I just want to show you what will fit. So I have this small size brush. So that fits. So you can see it's not coming up to the top. So this is my S10 Plus and that so that fits in the back pocket. So you'll see the back has two slots and the phone fits great. So can you see it's kind of sticking up but it's not like sticking out over the top. So, so that's a full bag. So I've never had a bucket bag before, so I'm not sure how much this should cinch in. But I noticed this one doesn't cinch as much. So the top, so even after cinching as much as I can, it's still open like that. So I would actually just carry this as a crossbody bag or even a top handle so it stays in front of me because again the opening is so the opening I think is still kind of big for um, someone to just grab something so here's so here it is a little bit tighter so that's what it looks like and then there's the top so that's as much as I can cinch and again so you can kind of reach in and grab stuff so I'm just showing you how much I can fit in here but normally I don't carry all this stuff so let me show you what else can fit in here all right, so, I, so I took everything out again so this one is my Gucci Bloom I think they consider that a card case but anyways it's definitely smaller than my compact wallet so let's put that in there and I also have my Kindle so that's what it looks like so my sunglasses so I have a bottle of water so I just want to show you if the water bottle fits and it does 
So there you go. So I want to show you how it's not protruding from the top. So it's still pretty good, but it is quite heavy. So with the full-size water bottle in there, my Kindle, a, a wallet, and my sunglass case. So this is a small size. So considering that this is classified as a small bag, I think it fits a lot. And then in the back pocket, you can put so in the back pocket, I just inserted this coin case and that fits. So let me try to close it. So that's as much as I can close. So you see the, the top. But yeah, so this is so this is the cute size. It's not overly big, nor is it the mini size. So it fits a ton. And it's comfortable holding this as like as a, as a top handle. So let me show you how this looks on me. So this has one, two, three, four. So this has five notches. Let me show you how it looks on me. Okay, so because the opening is still pretty big after I've cinched it as much as I can, so I actually prefer carrying this as a crossbody bag so it's in front of me and not like to the side. But so I have it, so I have this on the longest setting and I'm 5'4. So this is on the shoulder and it's pretty long. And then this is wearing it as a crossbody. So I would actually shorten the strap because I, I think it's still a little bit too long for me. And then this is by the top handle, which I think looks so cute. So even though it's a small bag, a lot can fit in here. So hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video.